Hello and welcome. In this video tutorial, we will show how to use the receiver modification wizard within the XTS management wizards. The receiver modification wizard can be used to filter to a set of domains, select a receiver, modify its parameters, and update all matching receiver parameters within the set of domains. Let's get started. First, you will need to select the receiver modification wizard. Next, click on the Take Ownership button and click Yes in the prompt. The first step will be to select a receiver. Click on Select Receiver in the left pane. Then click on the Select Receiver button. Within the Add a Receiver to Edit Delete dialog window, you will see each assigned receiver for the domains. For this example, only one receiver has been assigned. It is the delimited file receiver. Click on the plus to add it. Within the receiver modification wizard, you will see the parameters for the selected receiver. Here you can change the receiver name or modify any of the parameter values for the selected receiver. For this example, we are going to change include header to false by using the drop down menu. Once you have made changes to the receiver's parameter values, you will need to click on the Save Changes button. The next step will be to select the domains the receiver parameter value will be updated for. Click on Select Domains in the left pane. You will need to select a search criteria option. Depending on the option you have selected, you may need to enter a keyword. For this example, we have selected all, so a keyword is not necessary. Once finished, click the filter button. All domains matching the configured search criteria will be displayed below the search criteria in a table. You can use the checkboxes to select individual domains or the select all option to select all domains. The modified receiver parameters will be updated for each selected domain in this table. Once finished, you will need to execute the changes. Click on Execute Changes in the left pane, and then click on Start Execution. Click Yes in the prompt. Once the process has finished, you will see a log and its status. Click on the home icon to view a summary. Here you can see the selected receiver, the selected domains, and the status of the executed changes. Click on click to confirm and validate the execution changes to complete this process. And then click yes in the prompt. To return to the XTS management wizards, click on XTS wizards within the breadcrumb bar. This concludes our tutorial on the receiver modification wizard within the XTS management wizards. Thank you for watching.